that in the first few rows, you are seated in these black zones. Okay, take a look at the seats right now. If they are blue in color, that means they're gonna get really, really wet. However, should you choose to remain in your seat, brace yourself for a splashing good time. Secondly, throughout the show, I need everyone to remain seated because any sudden movements may distract our sea line. And last but not least, after the show, please exit the amphitheater in an orderly manner. Can we all do that? Alright, let me see if my sea line is ready. You guys said that? It's very exciting to meet all of you guys. Well, I am ready, but the most important question is, are you guys ready for the show? And you know what? I'm gonna be honest, that was actually pretty good. But I need you guys to be louder than that. Are you guys ready for the show? Fast swim 
doing bad? Why is he doing bad? Can't he just say no? No, why? Uh, say earlier on, he saw something big, something scary in the pool. Something big and scary in the pool? Nonsense! I'm looking at the pool right now, there's nothing big and scary. Okay, you know what? Let's ask everyone here. Do you guys see anything big and scary in the pool? Look at that, he does not believe any one of us. He has to check for himself. All right, Pumba, if you think that the coast is clear, you can turn up the speed. Is that a shark, Pumba? If that was a shark, he would have you for dinner. Stop playing around and turn up the speed. Glass panels. If 
you see that that his eyes are wide open, you are not mistaken. This is because sea lions have very special membrane covering their eyes, which help them see clearly underwater. Just like that. Now we know that sea lions cannot resist fish and especially Pumba who weighs about 200 kilograms simply loves this fish. But trainer Raymond says that Pumba is so well trained he will not touch that piece of fish until he hears a signal from his trainer which is a single clap. Okay? So what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna distract him. I'm gonna count to three, you guys are gonna clap. Can you do that? Yeah. All right, hands up. One, two, three. <laughs> Let's keep it tight, okay? One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Look at him being such a good boy today, okay? You know what? We're not gonna give up. We're gonna try this one last time, okay? Heads up. One. <laughs> one, two, three. You know what? Give yourself a big round of applause. You all are so easy to train. I'm just kidding, as you can see, the piece of fish is still right there, right now, it's great when it's flat. And there we have it! Now the reason he did not touch that piece of fish is because he knows he's gonna get a whole lot more, not that one, a whole lot more for a job.
use the use of single-use plastic just like a plastic water bottle. Instead, we can offer one that's sturdy and hardy just like the one Puma is holding on to right there. And last but not least, we have the last R, but I'm not going to say anything about it because in a while, Puma is going to show all of us how to recycle. Look at that, we pick up the litter that's right in front of us. Head on to the nearest recycling center and... <laughs> Almost there, Puma, come on. And we did it! Now, if a sea lion can do his part to protect our environment, so can the rest of us. And together, we can put a stop to the ocean's deadliest monsters. the show but before we go Puma has one last look to show all of you ladies and gentlemen get ready this is what we call Paw Passage